take out a bunch of screenshots for other YouTubers as well. Oh, well, that's that's nice. Ready for order. Ready for battle. Yes, um, Commander. You, you got some other way to get paid as well. Ready for orders. Right, these are fisheries. What do I need to actually get the next tier of this? noises <laughs> Chat yeah, Italian Etruscan mercenaries yup <laughs> oh, that was fucking funny he just their army just marched from uh, like over here somewhere I didn't see them they just marched up here and attacked that ran into spears that was a pretty easy battle as well Yeah, I think I'm gonna lose that fleet next turn, I think. Don't get paid for thumbnails, really. You at least uh you at least uh get what was I gonna say? Get to spawn well, a shout out or whatnot on the channels you do. No level ups sadly this turn. Let's see what happens. Okay, that's to be expected. Run! No, you don't need to. You see, I don't put much effort into the, th into the thumbnails, to be honest. I just took a screenshot of the main menu for this and that's it. From time to time you get a shout out. But, well, I think if, you, if you're, you're the thumbnail guy, you should get the shout out, right? I work with getting a couple of subs. About, I'd say about 10 a week or something like that. I'm not too bothered about that stuff, to be honest. As long as there's a couple people who enjoy the streams and the videos, I'm fine with it. Because, like I said, I would I would be playing this either way, you know. So, me streaming it or not, you know, doesn't matter that much if you get viewers, stream, uh, subs, or whatnot. It doesn't matter that much to me. We do have Santa Sammy, who has donated way too much at this point. Oh, you're a shit diplomat, man. Why didn't you bring cash back? Doing well with Bannerlord? Oh, uh, well. I am, I am, I do want to like try out a bunch of mods and I do like do a little bit of, I don't do like the short video content for the mods or previews. So I guess uh, people like want to watch how the game actually, how the mod actually plays. Okay, let's see. I think they're going to drop up there. So let's get uh, going that way. This is gonna give us more replenishment. Plus, I have a, a whole playthrough uploaded, the Viking one, and I need to schedule that. Then I'm gonna have the Tessogen one. Uh, there's gonna be a lot of videos till like the end of the year, in a couple of months. No, uh, not really. The war in Ukraine, well, except the gas prices and all that, that's to be expected, but uh, otherwise, not really, not at all. Except the fact that the question of uh, Kosovo has popped up again. 
and the fact that um, the same shit's happening but this time we're gonna uphold the cons the uh how would that be called the integrity and the constitutional land of what dreams constitutional land of um, ukraine but we didn't do that for serbia why would we Serve Rome. It's gonna take two turns to re recruit that. I don't wanna sit I don't wanna sit in there so they can get some replenishment. Hmm. At your command. Ready for orders. Ready for battle. Actually You go this Advice. way. Ready for further orders. Gonna get another At brink bay. And you Come a little bit closer. The center of an ambush. Okay, so they can only throw. Interesting <laughs> point of view. Well, uh, that's why it's alternative perspective, right? Well, there's one new mod which is like a uh, Middle Ages Crusaders versus uh, well, Crusade basically the Crusade. I think third third Crusade era, somewhere about there. I am gonna be doing that one next. I'm doing uh, the Tessujin one, which is like basically samurai added into Warband or Battle Lord. How can I serve Rome? Okay, thinking of. I think they're gonna land up there. I don't want to get rid of that spy, but I, I don't want to. I mean, the SM, my, my agents are not that good, as per usual. You want to upgrade anything though? Not really. Right, maybe I should tax this now, right? Yeah, look at that money. We can definitely do some uh, Berlod mod previews and such. And especially if you can get, get into some of the beta versions of the mods on the Gilded servers. On well, well, most of the stuff on mod DB is not out yet. So if you can like grab a beta version. Uh, Samurai is in Calradia, yeah. And the Empire is united. I have a mod that unites the Empire. So, like, oh, the whole Empire is one faction. And surprisingly, uh, because I have the, the blame, you know, they aren't that big of a threat. I am gonna do Eagle Rising again once they put in Carthaginians. Because. Of course. We gotta kill the Carthaginians. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm gonna try to make get them to or bait them there. It should be pretty easy to kill off with this. Should. Who got to level up? Okay, you did. Uh what did I wanna do with the Capable bureaucrat. It's always funny to me that you can actually pick all of these. Like surely this one would uh, disable this one. Or the other way around. Civil research and public order. Uh, let's go for tax rate first. I'm actually surprised they are going to make uh, Carthage next. I was thinking they are going to make the Carthage, Carthaginian faction the last. And they are going to make uh, the Greeks, the Parthians first. 
that's the uh, is that the in they're missing I'm missing one faction I can't remember which one though Macedonians Let's see if we can get another big battle and run through that trade system in Rome mm. well like uh, no, bo both the trade system in uh, Realm 2 and Attila are fine, in my opinion. The only problem is if you don't play like with a mod that increases turn time, or like, you know, 12 turns per year or 8 turns per year, uh, your generals just die off so quick. I mean. Yeah, Greeks were. Uh, well. They do need to like kind of differentiate them a little bit because they're gonna make the they're gonna make one faction that like is pro Roman and the other one is like pro Greek, right? If I remember, Macedonians. So they have to like differentiate them a little bit. And again, that is the like same model, just maybe a different weapon. But like the Macedonians are gonna have like longer spears or something, or the phalanx. Those fucking pirates up there. G go deal with them. Come on. You can do it. it is an honor to serve Rome. Fleet report oh, this is funny. To battle. Moving out. Wipe them out. Bye bye. So much for a full stack, right? Easy into port. Fleet reporting. Okay, Dimus Maximus. All right, uh, he didn't level up actually. I do need to get night battles for this so I can actually. Mm, okay, for all units. Or ship defenders, never mind. Support escorts. Missile damage, ramming. Like, you want to pick the ones that are going to increase your chances in auto resolve because I don't want to do naval battles. No one wants to do naval battles. No, no, no. I don't do naval battles, man. Until I get the catapult boats, I don't do the naval battles. No defense skill for all units. Alright, I guess I could do one naval battle at some point. Maybe that was the best, like, best chance we could have gotten. Because uh, they were all just uh, land troops. We hunger for battle. What you doing there, guy? Ready for orders. Okay, these have uh, replenished more or less. We hunger for battle. Okay, next turn I'm gonna move these guys to take out the Pirates up there. I'm gonna leave him at Syracuse. For Ready for orders. We hunger for battle. We cannot pass here. The way is blocked. The way is blocked, my ass. We need food all, food all over the place. Ah, oh, shut up. We for oh my god, it takes so long. Uh. Problem is, I have a feeling that, like, uh, they're... Uh, Sorry, Nico Kowatch, I can't read that. I'm not Russian. As you command. I do know Cyrillic, but not that Cyrillic. Ready for orders. What?
I guess that's the problem because I didn't set sail from... Ah, I should have killed these guys long ago, so we have a port up here. Okay, it would take three turns to get over there. Let's see how much casualties they suffer. Yes. <laughs> or yeah. These guys are gonna fuck up the, the, the public order here, unfortunately. I wanna have reminiscence still up there. Let's see, let's see. We don't have enough money for that. Yeah, fuck off somewhere over there. Alright, they had, had an army up there as well. Which means I can't take too much damage with that army up there because they're gonna get attacked immediately. Look at the Spartans attacking Athena. Oh, nice. Unfortunately, I think they hate us. I know speak English. Sorry, man. I know Serbian, but that's not gonna help you. Well, I am... Not that I know Serbian, I am Serbian. Oh, you pieces of shit. you move away further? I do love how Rose just sits there, there's nothing. Ooh. I don't think we're gonna have enough until we get there. Leaving the ship. Okay, you. Go schmooze the Spartans, because I think they're gonna take Athena. Now, I can't remember if... Well, if they do attack uh, the settlement up there, I don't think they have enough to actually beat us over there. Okay, you. You go deal with that. The army with more ambush chance was spotted. Wonderful. Yeah, let's move on over there. Set them on patrol. Okay, research that. Let's see. Let's research this so we get some movement on the campaign map. I'm questioning if we, I'm questioning if we we're gonna have enough food. Okay, here we're definitely gonna have enough food for that. Oh god, it's gonna take two turns to get over there. Right, so... Oh well, fuck, I can't see. And you can't, like, a... Uh, little tactician. Knight Commander level 3 on for Lightning Strike. Each craft expert, effective ambusher. I can't see the third one, goddammit. Commander Men Booming Voice, Red Commander, Proven Leader, Sworn Bodyguard, Experienced Archer, Skilled Cavalryman, Trained Swordman, Drill Master. Master of Skimming, Tilted Conscriptor, Quartermaster, Mercenary.
God damn it, I wish I can see the third one now. Uh, normal scenario unit recruitment cost, replenishment to all units, line of sight, movement range. I think we we're gonna need movement range. Morale forward mercenary. Yeah, movement range. Now let's see. Okay, there it is. Do we need level 3? Well, let's start going towards that. It is an honor to serve Rome. Oh, this guy shouldn't have like a higher chance to spot us there. Ready for orders. At your command. Okay, I did think I think I did send that guy over there to do something. Let me check this again. something stupid probably not. they're probably just gonna raid which is just gonna piss me off oh there they there they go fucking a million stacks from out of nowhere I think someone told me that the barbarians up there up the north are gonna declare war on us. But it might be a thing where you need to take the full province so they like trigger something hard coded into the AI to attack you. Might be something like that. It might be actually a good thing we didn't take out this last barbarian faction up there. You fucking piece of shit. But you go do something useful for a change. Like schmooze the Athenians. Be welcome. But may Athena strike us all dumb if we speak anything but truth in our deliberations. Give me all the money. We have an agreement, and I'm sure I have some decent... I do like how you get a little bit of lore for every, like, city you click on. Well, most, like, major cities you click on. Right. God, the pirates are so annoying. The fuck are you doing? I guess they could blockade us, I guess. Oh, now they have a spy here. Ready for orders. What's the chance of actually killing it? Yes, it does. Ready for orders. Ready for battle. At your command. Can I? Commander. No, that's becoming annoying, to be honest. Agents of Russian. 10% chance of trap. Okay, I better not do that then. Okay, they can attack Syracuse, but I got an army there. Okay, 
Okay, we had Valor is the one we needed. Uh, if I remember correctly, you can... Was there a thing where you can place your army into a fleet or something? I think you can, so let's move them up here and see. Or I'm, I might be thinking of some other game. I think you can place them with the fleet so they can move them around a little bit faster or something like that. I kind of don't want to start recruiting a fleet here just because uh, it, they might take him out. Sanitation is pretty good there. This is going from two to four. Four. This is minus three. Hmm. They're not gonna have. We're not gonna have enough food here, so let's not do that. Question what the AI does sometimes. It looks like they're going for my fleet. As if they know they are, I want to go and attack Corsica and Sardinia. It means it might be time to recruit another fleet. Or actually, I think... Uh, I think Epirus is still at war with uh, Syracuse, uh, not Syracuse, Carthaginian, Carthaginians. A token, perhaps a modest gift of coin, would have my people see you in a new light. Nope. Incursus has rage for civilian tech tree. Mm, nice. Fortunately, we're not researching civilian shit right now. Okay, bye bye. Action destroyed. Noise. Fortunately, we did lose uh, quite a bit of troops. I love to check. So, can we do that? Okay, so we can. Good. Yeah, that's what I wanted to know. That's an admiral. Yeah, both of these are an admiral. Hmm. At your command. Can they both get there in one turn? They might actually try and take this. So we'll just uh, recruit those just in case.
Junia, Cornelia, Cornelia. I guess we're gonna go with this one. Your orders. Ships to port. We need good, strong men. All right, we can't recruit these up here. But let's not do that. But we should be able to get some archers. Never mind. Okay, this is an army. That's gonna be another full stack. Should bait him into attacking Syracuse. Let's try and do that. My wits and words are yours. Yeah, I think I fucked up with this one. Should have gone for this. Let's go with growth and that. Cultural differences. Oh, come on. Oh, this is interesting. I think they just took Apollonia. They did not. Did they actually lose that battle up there? Seems like it. Yeah, they like uh, the navy units you get are not that good on the field. Well, except uh, if they're Roman ones, they're pretty good because they're basically just legionaries or bring pace as The fuck are you doing there? Damn it, they saw us. Pirates spotted where? I'm really losing trade because of that. <laughs> Lovely. I will do anything for Rome. Knife in the rib. I have paid him blood. This shit. <laughs> At your command. Fight. Bear. Ready for orders. Yeah, they they got fucking beaten back. <laughs> Shitty Carthaginians. No, right, they came here since uh, I have way to actually take them out. Yeah, but you guys start coming this way. Any mercenaries here? Steady as we go. All right, wait. So I can recruit from a military war fuck. Yeah, it's the same season, isn't it? 
Yeah, sure. Let's uh, grab these ones first. Weapon check. I'm not sure if the fire pot by reams are any good or not. Honestly. Carthage cannot stand against the might of Epirus, let alone Rome. Apparently. <laughs> they can't take out poor little Epirus with a single city. <laughs> This is uh, two stacks that can attack us. Maybe even three. Commander. Police reporting. Unfortunately, we don't have actually we don't have actually enough people here. Yeah, we have like zero plebs. These guys are kind of annoying, so let's stay there just in case. We hunger for battle. Disband these. You come over here. Okay, one turn, that's going to be finished. I think we want to go for, let's see, okay, we're not building any of these, none of these are going to help us, I think I should go for uh, the philosophy tree. Next. How may I serve you? Party loyalty, yes. Let's go for uh, culture conversion. Let's see which one of these growth. Oh, oh, action, action. Looks like they fell for it. How many cav units they have? Oh shit! Oh my god, they got three elephants. As well. Oh, I'd actually lose this battle. Just because uh, the. Uh, the garrison is decent, but like the problem here is the. Uh, it's gonna be a while till we get these into the city. But we do have enough downy swordsmen to hold the. the shoreline. Let's do it. And I did up the difficulty on the battles as well to hard. It all depends on the layout of the settlement, I guess.
the defenders of the new city. The friends of the hundred and the four and, and four. Hundred and four. Okay, you are gonna be I can't tell I can't remember if they can land there. So let's place like one up here. Well, the like biggest problem here, I don't know where the elephants are coming from. And this is actually not that defensible, to be honest. Got the entry point there, 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 here. Yeah. All of this. <laughs> Best of luck. The Roman gods are with us. I'm gonna hope. If their cavalry comes from here, we're fucked. If they come from this side, I think we're gonna be able to do something about it. Romans, ready for duty. Spearman, at the red. Thankfully, we have a decent amount of spearmen. Heavy cavalry, ready and willing. Oh. All right, we get one uh, horseman. Forgot about that. Let's see. I'm gonna assume they're gonna land on the on the beach here, not here. I hope so, at least. Because like holding this is gonna be a pain in the ass. They're not gonna hold there, but uh, let's do it like that. Let me just place the spearmen up first. better like this Sons of Mars. because we do need to leave flanking paths open kind of a little bit is this passable okay it doesn't look like they can pass through there This what I mean. This side is wide open. I'm gonna leave the slingers here because I don't know where their elephants are gonna come from. Italian swordsmen, swords. These are gonna be pretty good for holding down the anything that comes off the ships first. Let's see. Elephants, elephants. Enemy reinforcements approaching. Ooh. Okay, I think I think this is good. We can hold here. Bring these guys back here as well. Let me check. Oh god. I think the morale is going to be the biggest issue here. Let's see, there's only three ships coming in. Okay, good, we could, uh, we could have uh, left them all there. Let's see. Okay, this side is only Cav. Question is... 
Mm. Actually, it might be smarter to just stay there. You stay there as well. Force this side. This one building here is fucking me over. And you, you just stay there, actually. Okay, these two. And this one's gonna go over there. Set up these skirmishers here. That might be too close. Oh my. There we go. You can block this like this here. Maybe. Maybe. Yeah, this one's gonna be a pain in the ass, especially since uh, the troops we do have are... Well, we do have uh, some Prinka Bays and some Roman troops over there, but the uh, rest are just... Uh, uh, client troops. Or shitty... Well, shitty spearmen, but those shitty spearmen might save our asses this time. Can I park them there? I want to place a couple of these behind them as well, as a buffer. Actually, just one of them behind them. We're going to use these three to hold these back. As they come in. Okay, so this is a... Okay, they do have a Scorpio. So we don't want actually to be... Scorpio and two archers. So we don't want to be close to the... Uh, shore there. Oh my god, they're coming from all over the place. That's gonna change things a bit. You guys, run your asses here. How many elephants do they count? These guys have three sets of elephants. I'm gonna place the Veltes. Now it seems all of them are gonna clash here, so we could use some other troops to flank them. Let's put these guys up here. Our baggage train is actually coming into the fight. That's not good. I don't have a place to put them where they're not going to be annoying. I'm going to place everyone on... We're gonna place everyone on defensive stand. What? Okay, apparently not. You 
Yeah, I'm here as well. Yeah, I think all of them are just gonna come that way. So we could use these to, to flank them and sandwich them. The guys are not in place yet. I do hope I didn't miss an area where they can like squeeze through or something. Okay, yeah, it looks like they're ignoring this side. The question is do I have enough time to actually flank them? I hope so. gonna group those up together you're gonna come this way I said you're gonna come this way you're gonna you're gonna okay there we go I hope God I hope to God that's not passable otherwise we might be fucked this bunch to flank. Now I'm not sure if I want to use my cav to rear charge this. I think they're gonna all land at the same time. So we're gonna face the full brunt. Well, almost the same time. So we're gonna face the full One brunt of, the of them. Used all its ammunition. Right, I need to tell these to actually shoot at the elephants. Actually, I don't think that's gonna matter much. Okay, where are the Italian horsemen? You come out here. What? Yeah, that's what that's I needed to see that, that's for sure. Right, let's set these guys up for a uh, defense. We're gonna need to hold as many of these choke points as possible. Or actually, let's set these guys up over here first. I hope to God these don't like go in here to dis disembark that that's going to be painful come on move faster god damn it and this guy is going to count as a general as well oh that's going to suck ass one of our units has used all its ammunition Ready for order. 
These guys, are, I think there's more pressure over here. Let's move him over there. Let me actually bring my cab over there. Some more units here, Veltes. I think we're gonna need to use them on here on them. Yeah, so let's move them there. However, these guys. Oh yeah, the AI is not too bright in this. Oh right, these are my ship. I was like, what? Ships with no men on them. Let's uh, set the slingers up there. Oh my god, there's so many of these guys. They're so freaking annoying. Actually, I don't think they provide requ requirements for replenishment, prevent attrition, desert. Double. I don't. I think. I don't think they provide anything in battle. So we can just leave them up here. Hopefully they're not going to get sniped by some retreating cab or something. They'll leave him like up here. Can we move the slingers? Let's see about rest. these guys to hold while we flank with the other troops now it looks like they want to like uh, let's place them here and I'll see we're actually in the middle here then I'll see where they want to go actually because they might uh, end up just deploying everything on this side that's gonna be good for us it's because that means they're gonna either go through here or here do nothing else. In melee combat even. Right, these are... Actually, the game doesn't want to tell me what these are. I think like something like cataphracts, early cataphracts. Alright, let's uh prank pays. Okay, these are elite troops. I think we're gonna need to flank with them. You stay there. Yeah, these guys are taking a beating. 